Your sincere condolences won't be enough. When a North Korean leader dies, citizens are required to show intense public mourning and hysteria as a sign of their admiration. For example, when Kim Jong-il died in 2011, the government declared a hundred days of mourning. During those days, anyone found laughing or singing could be sent to a prison camp with their families. Also, anyone who refused to go to the streets to cry for their leader could even face execution. But wait, just crying wouldn't be enough as undercover government agents checked if the crime looked sincere, so you better put on an Oscar-worthy performance when going to the streets. If not, your life could be in danger. Send this video to a friend who would cry their way through those hundred days of mourning.